Okay, so we have a DV9000 here. It has the uh, Go 6150 uh, chipset on it, which is shared memory. So what we're going to do is turn this on and see what happens. We get the blue lights. Uh, we do not get hard drive activity. And nothing shows up on the screen. So this could be one of three things, uh, especially with these units. They have the AMD, the NVIDIA, and uh, they have DDR2 memory. So, what we need to do is test and see first with the memory, then check the uh, processor, and then move on to the chipset and see if that's the issue. Because all three of them could act like a bad GPU. So. What we're going to do is take this part and check the memory first and see what we find. Okay, so now we're reflowing this. Uh, we're going to start with this chipset right here. Then we're going to move to this one. So it's pretty common that would be a uh, two chipset reflow. Um, sometimes we have a three chipset reflow. That would be if we had one off to the side here with the VRAMs which we don't. So what we're going to do is allow this to get up to town and then we're going to uh, put the light on and start reflowing it. So we'll check it after that. See if the processor is bad. The memory is already checked as good. So we'll go from there. Okay so we have our uh, DV9000 here and it's plugged up. We're turning it on. Let's see what happens. Hopefully we'll get video out of it. So we can see that uh, video is working on it and we're in. So what we're going to do is allow this to run for two hours and burn in and then we'll be done. But for right now we're going to say it's done. So we're done with this machine and it's up and running.